Good afternoon, YouTube. This is Econ K88, and I'm still in Las Vegas. And this place is called the Center on Tropicana. And it looks like a see through building. At least one. There might be more than one. Newer construction. There's some kids over here skateboarding. I guess they'll have plenty to do around here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six units in building number one, and there is a second building. Looks like there's a little bit of vandalism that's happened here. And one, two, three, four, five, oh, more than six, several. Windows have been knocked out. We'll turn around here. There, there are a bunch of apartments across the street. This is not on the outskirts of town. This is right in the middle of town. So somebody found this vacant strip of land and decided what the hell I'm gonna jump on this real estate bubble grab the bull by the horns and see what happens and next to it here is some other, some other uh, vacant property looks like some dirt's been pushed around some lot lines are in place there's a fire hydrant over there if you can see it so they were gonna build probably the same type of silliness over there that they built here Two see-through buildings, and I can probably find dozens just like this if I looked hard enough throughout the Las Vegas area. I already have found probably a couple dozen, but I could probably find 2,008. So these idiots were post-bubble peak in building this. And it doesn't look like anything has ever occupied any of these spaces. So here's these kids over here again. There's a CVS pharmacy here. At least the kids are out doing something instead of just sitting behind a, a computer screen playing video games all day. Vegas is kind of a dangerous city, so it's... You have to be careful letting kids outside to play here, I suppose. Here's the front of the buildings. This is Econ Cat 88 signing off from Las Vegas, Nevada. Real estate and a retail train wreck in the Greater Depression. Ground Zero.